Welcome to the first video on 3B03 PHY Mechanics 2. This uh, course is offered for the BSc Physics students studying in the third semester of Government College Castorot. Before I introduce the syllabus and scheme and structures, I would like to tell you a few things uh, that uh, you are going to uh, learn physics. That means your brain is going to do a lot of workout. So you need to have the following things. The first thing is that you need to have a very good amount of uh, concentration. So concentration or focus is defined as your uh, ability to keep your attention on a particular object or any kind of stimulation uh, for a longer period of time without getting uh, distracted. There are a lot of methods you can check your concentration. One of the method is to keep your attention on a particular object and see how long you can keep your attention on that object. So for example, take a pen and um, look into its tip and start counting 1, 2, 3. So your uh, attention has to be on its tip. Your brain should not uh, think something else. Uh, so you keep your attention on the tip and start counting 1, 2, 3 and see at what number you get distracted to some object like smartphone or WhatsApp or any kind of object. So if the number is uh, large, that means you have very good amount of concentration. If the number is low, then that means you have low level of concentration. If you have low level of concentration, you don't have to worry about it. You can practice and improve it. There are, there are different methods to improve your concentration. One of the simplest method is to keep your attention on a particular object and uh, try to keep your attention on a particular object. So let's take that example, like um, take a pen and look into its tip and count one, two, three, four. By the time your mind get, will get distracted some other object, bring it back. Again, start count one, two, three, four. At some number, again, your mind will get distracted to some other object like smartphone, some app or some friends bring it back and do this for uh, two minutes every day and do it for two to three months. So by the end of two to three months, you will have a very good amount of concentration. So here uh, the intensity does not matter. Here the uh, consistency is uh, very important. So you have to do this uh, exercise every day uh, for uh, two minutes and you have to do it for two to three months. If you do a very heavy exercise for one or two days, nothing will happen. You have to do it uh, repeatedly. So the intensity does not matter, but consistency is important. If you ask a gym trainer, he will also give similar answer. In order to develop muscle, you have to do a little bit uh, exercise every day uh, for uh, roughly six months or so. So if you do a heavy workout for one or two days, your muscle is not going to develop. Okay, this is one thing you need to have very good amount of concentration. If you don't have good amount of concentration, you practice and improve your concentration. The second thing is that you are going to learn physics that means you are, you are going to think and visualize a lot of things that means your brain is going to consume a lot of energy so you have to supply the brain that much energy so you have to have a good uh, and proper amount of food and you have to have a good amount of water so there are different methods you can learn physics so the best way of learning something is to make it if you if you are able to make something that means you know pretty much about it everything about it so that is the best way and the second better way is to teach something so if you can teach then you you should know most of the thing so that is the second um, method and um, the third method is uh, to read think visualize and make your own note that is the third method of learning and the fourth uh, method is attending uh, offline classrooms physical classrooms and interacting with teachers or instructors so that is the fourth method of learning and fifth method of learning is attending online classes and interact with the teachers via uh, some device uh, that's the fifth way of learning and the sixth way of uh, learning is uh, uh, watching some video or, or some audio and think and visualize uh, what it is the seventh way of learning is to uh, use some visualizing app or some media or some website uh, and learn from that so I, I rank this uh, visualizing app and uh, website in the seventh position uh, because uh, the app or the um, uh, media will think and visualize for you and you don't have to think a lot. Uh, so the negative side is that uh, you, uh, your brain is not going to do a lot of workout. That means your brain is not going to improve or your thinking capability is not going to improve. So what make a human different from other animals is its thinking capability. So you have to improve your uh, thinking capability. So you have to uh, think and improve your thinking capability. 
so we will uh, during this lockdown we will be following uh, roughly this uh, fifth uh, or uh, sixth uh, method of learning like an online class and a video once the lockdown is over and when we start the physical classroom we will go to the other third or fourth way of learning uh, let me introduce uh, what is the um, uh, syllabus and subject so this course is uh, 3b03 phy mechanics 2 and uh, this course is uh, uh, offered for the third semester of BSc Physics program of Kanduru University. The total credit is 3 and the total teaching hours will be 58. Uh, so, the total mark will be 50 and maximum external mark will be 40 and maximum internal marks will be 10. So, the internal mark distribution is given here. You can pause the video and look into it. Grading uh, scheme is given here. You can have a look into it. And this is the uh, program outcome of uh, Kanduru University which means that the, at the end of the uh, BSc program from Kanduri University, you are going to achieve these things. And this is the program specific uh, outcome. So, this is specific for BSc Physics program. So, at the end of the, the BSc Physics program, you are uh, going to achieve uh, these um, uh, things which is listed here. And uh, I'll, look, I'll show you the syllabus. This is the first unit of your syllabus. Uh, you can pause and take a note if you want. This is the second unit of your syllabus. Uh, this is the third unit of your syllabus. This is the fourth unit of your uh, syllabus. This is the fifth unit. And these are the books for study. And there are uh, three books and one book for reference. Uh, thanks a lot uh, for watching this video. I am Dr. Pradeep, uh, your physics teacher. Improve your concentration, hydrate your body. Please watch the next video.